wholeness harmonious vibrations thank you so much for stopping by i am divine lady nin Hersog, your sister of a distant moon and i have come to serve you i am a spiritual life coach mentor entrepreneur and an author i am one of the 29 authors in the what is beauty movement uh book journal and six-week coaching program well i'm Making this video today, I just want to make sure I give apology to my uh, accountability partners, Christina Mazanares and Shannon Font. Uh, I apologize, I did not make my video yesterday. I was still very wore out uh, after Saturday's event, and I, I apologize. Um, I'm actually making at least two videos today. I know that it's about consistency, so this will not be an excuse to um, not make a video and then make, you know, like five videos in one day. That is not my intent. Uh, I was a little down in the dumps, not really feeling myself. Mm, you know, I was playing the self-pity game you know and sometimes when things don't go right in our lives or go the way we expect them to go because all is in divine order and as it should be we just make these perceptions up in our head of how we think they should go when we should really just surrender and do what we know we need to do so yes yesterday Katina was being a brat I was being a little bit of a brat, and I didn't feel like it. My body was hurting after traveling the weekend, and I was just too tired, and I just didn't want to get up and do it. Um, and I was extremely tired, but that is no excuse because I could have did it earlier in the earlier part of the day. Um, <clears throat> one thing I've been following, um, this guy, he's a... I think he's a billionaire. Is he a billionaire or a millionaire? I'm not quite sure. Okay, but he's he has a lot of money. <laughs> and he's only about 30 years old, if that. And his name is Sam Ovens. And I've been following him. And he has this spreadsheet called the 8020. And what it does is he has all these categories. He has categories um, of activities. And then he put a value on the categories. So one category is minus $100. Then the other category is $0. Then the next category is $100. Oh, and those are per hour. $100 an hour. Then the next category is $1,000 an hour. Then the next category is $10,000 an hour. On up to $100,000 an hour. Okay. So what he's done is he's listed like all these activities under each category that are valued at that particular dollar amount. So basically, what you do is you fill in this calendar and it gives you an idea of where you're spending your time. Like what are you doing with your time? And I know that I was doing some minus hundred dollar an hour activities like scrolling Facebook <laughs> or watching Netflix or you know looking into somebody else's life instead of paying attention to your own um, then there are some zero activities I really don't have that in front of me because I didn't know that I was going to talk about that right now but yeah I'm definitely going to download that spreadsheet isn't that a good idea that is a really good idea and it will help you to determine, especially for people that are entrepreneurs and like you want to make the best of your time. This is a great opportunity for you to catalog it. And it's not for anybody else. It's for yourself. But it'll help you see like where all your time is going. Like in a 24 hour day or however long you sleep. I mean, average people sleep about six to eight hours a night. Um, I love sleep, but... I still can't seem to sleep any more in one stretch, you know, any more than about six, seven hours. Now, I may go back and take a nap, 
you know, I love my naps. You know, they, there are countries that they actually, everybody gets to take a nap. So, you know, <laughs> I think they call it a high sienda. <laughs> so, yes, um, I love my rest. But to be successful, we're going to have to definitely, um, I'm going to have to definitely look at where my time is being spent, how I'm spending my time, and even sleep. Sleep is also an opportunity for you to create. Um, I don't look at sleep the same. I've actually been studying, uh, looking into the Neville Goddard method of manifesting. And yeah, sleep is beautiful. I mean, you can do a lot of things. See, because when you're asleep, your subconscious mind is working. And your subconscious mind is what gets things done. Your regular awake mind, your conscious, your, you know, your um, conscious mind, that's not the mind that gets things done. It's your subconscious minds that gets things done. So you can actually be interactive with your subconscious mind and you can create the life that you desire. And so, yes, I'm working on that. Hmm. <laughs> so yeah so sleep has its place also meditation is also on there I think he has meditate I, that would be considered that Neville Goddard method it would be considered a form of meditation um, because you're conscious you're not just falling asleep you know you're actually just going into sleep you have a ritual with going into your sleep uh, for you know the evening or for your nap or what have you so that would be considered a form of meditation and there's a category for that. And I actually think that it's in the $100,000 category meditation is. So I think Sam Ovens is definitely on to something with this chart of his. And I'm going to download it, uh, get a hold of that chart so that I can actually utilize it in my own life. So that I can create the life I desire. And so that I can hold myself accountable as well as with my accountability partners. And that way I won't be down in the dumps like I was yesterday and just, oh, I'm so tired. Oh, woe is me. Oh, Katina, poor baby. I won't be doing that. I mean, I may still feel it, but I'll be like, yeah, this right now is a minus hundred dollar activity. So <laughs> at least let me get to a zero activity so I won't be in the red. <laughs> at least. <laughs> so yeah, yesterday was really something else. Um, but I'm okay. I, I've gotten past it. I did some meditation. You know, spiritual practice. Your spiritual practice is definitely key to being able to uh, function daily um to actually be able to function and move forward with the plans that you want to fulfill for whatever day it is so that's a good opportunity um you know i do my spiritual practice i don't always do it but i am making an effort to do my spiritual practice in the morning so i did complete that this morning and that's why i feel a lot better with getting things done today so with that I'm going to sign off. I am Divine Lady Ninhursag, your sister of a distant moon, and I love you with my whole heart. Deuces. See you on the flip side.